You're never too old to game. Hey everybody, Grandpa's Gaming here, and we are on Mustang Valley Ranch. Uh, this is a game that's been out probably a week or so now. Uh, you can get it on the in-game uh, mod, mod hub. Also, uh, the game is for PC. Or I actually just put it this way. The game is for con consoles, PC, and Mac. So everybody can play it. What I want to do is uh, I'm going to do a channel update here. Also, we're going to look around at the map. Uh, let's do the update first. Uh, I'm going to be away from my computer for a couple weeks. Uh, won't be able to uh, do any recording. So please don't give up on me. Uh, I will return uh, again. It'll probably be. I may. I may get another video out yet. But after that, this and that, uh, I'll be away from uh, it for a couple weeks. Uh, but I shall return, as MacArthur said, uh, and we'll keep going. So, without further ado whatever that means let's jump into this Mustang Valley Ranch uh, when you uh, come into the game this is where you of course spawn in let's take a look at the map itself as you can see it is absolutely huge when I say huge it's actually just a one times map I think but the uh, maker of the map uh, had the Big Bud in mind. He wanted to make a map that was Big Bud friendly in the so in making it Big Bud was uh, there uh, for you know he was thinking about that. Uh, this uh, map ma maker also made several other maps and right now for life I can't think of what they are I just remember that. You may uh, see similarities might be the American Outback maybe I don't know you'll see some similarities uh, as we go around but anyhow uh, you start off with fields three and five there uh, and in comparison they look small but really they're not and uh, this map has a I don't know it's just sometimes you see maps that are Eh, you know that you just there's just maybe too much going on or whatever uh, this map here it's basically a farming map there's not really anything else there is some forestry uh, you got your three basic animals sheep cows pigs uh, but it's a what I would call a pure farming map and you know is there something about it it's just I mean, it's wide open. Uh, it's just got a good feeling to it. That's just about the only way I can say. Uh, I have collected a bunch of the coins, and that's what we'll, another thing we'll do before I'm done. We'll finish. I have one, two, three, four, five, six, about eight more to go to get all the coins. It is a very easy map to get the coins. Very, very easy. They, I mean, I guess they figured you need help. Uh, money wise you only start off with your bear you know like 20,000 you only start off with let's go to the store here I'll just show you you start off and I don't have any of the much of the starting I should say so you start off of just you start off with a small puma uh, I can't remember which one it is here uh, but you start off with a smaller tractor not a huge uh, harvester uh, nothing for the size of the map 
and also you start off with a uh, let's see the only thing that I've got so far that uh, came with the map is a small tipper I thought I'd hang on to it I might need it for the animals but other than that I have uh, I've worked the map a little bit I also uh, put some money in so I could get the equipment get what it started the way I want it and we're gonna go from there I've got all my big stuff also also what I did is uh, I'm a friend of Big Haas uh, part of a lot of what he's got going on so I've downloaded so right now I think other than that one uh, well the big bud pack but I've got his mods in here I've got this case I've got this uh, a case harvester case uh, tractor I've got the header uh, I do have this uh, cedar and I got this uh, sprayer also let's see I've got this guy this guy this guy actually I got everything I wanted to put everything of a uh, big Haas in here uh, you need to uh, check out his channel he does very good <laughs> very entertaining live streams is mainly what his big deal is his live streams uh so anyhow and he has uh he's uh, a map maker also he's uh he likes to uh, play around with mods and uh make them his way uh redo redo them and that type of thing so that's what he's done with it i haven't used it yet so anyhow so this is your main farm uh plot whatever you want to call it you got these uh large cylinder uh, uh, places to put your stuff and I, I like it because your big bud stuff can stay together and be totally you know enclosed whatever which is what I've done with it uh, so you got these uh, what six I think you got another six or three over there uh, you also got storage buildings as you can see over there is your uh, where your you put your grains and stuff you got fuel on the farm uh, again a lot of nice storage which I will more than likely absolutely fill up with stuff as I play and again here's your bins for uh, putting in and taking it out over there then on the other side of that I think was more storage yeah your uh, let's see jump around a little bit yeah so you get more on this side and then yeah, over here is where I got that starting uh, tipper which is uh, the, like the second one up or whatnot it's not a very large one so they don't start you off so it's kind of like they want you to look for the uh, coins and all that so anyhow what I have done on field uh, over here on three and five I've I have kind of set it up uh, none of your fields have anything on it they are not plow but they are uh, cultivated so I sprayed it I planted corn over here and I've got wheat over on five if that's the name of it yeah and uh, they're getting there I also then I'll put these uh, cedar and uh, uh, fertilizer in over here because these are you know close to the two fields that you start off with to work uh, this grass here don't look like much but you can mow it uh, I had been mowing here let's just actually I'm gonna let's just do a little mowing so I can show you what it looks like again it looks it looks don't look like it'll do it but it does uh, lower that turn it on get my follow me mod going uh, alrighty and I think I just gotta turn them on we'll mow a little bit just to show you uh, the what it looks like uh, you don't own this field but it allows you to mow uh, close to it which I think is awesome 
I like it where I don't like it where you're next to you got a nice big grass area but you don't own a field and it won't let you but right now we're over by field uh, four the biggest this is the biggest field on the map and you can mow by it and the reason why I mown over here is the animals are over there your animals are at the north your fields that you own are at the south and uh, so that's what the uh, grass texture looks like it looks funny but it mows so I don't know where in the United States uh, this looks like maybe somewhere out west I don't know I don't know where the well, I've already mowed here Let's go over here just to do it. You can barely tell where you've mowed, but and uh, let's see, he's uh, let's see, 67 percent. You can like go up and maybe down just part way, and the my forage wagon's got a 50,000 capacity, and then I've just been running it over uh, to the sheep. I've only bought sheep so far. I've got 25 sheep. Okay, and maybe it's, well, we can mow right here a little bit. So anyhow, yeah, I'm not actually wanting to work on it today. I wanted to show you guys the map, do the map, uh, do my uh, uh, update to my uh, channel. <coughs> but mainly, yeah, I wanted to do a uh, map review of Mustang Valley Ranch. I really, really like it. I don't know why. I mean, you know, it's just some maps kind of jump out at you and you like it. Uh, this is one of them. Okay, I'm at 99%. So now he's going to come flying up here. We'll go ahead and take him over to the animals. Uh, and again, what I kind of do when I start a map, you look, I got 644,000. I put in so much. Uh, get me some starting to get the map where I can play it and enjoy it. I don't feel like grinding out uh, to get very far. And then a lot of times, and I, I take the money mod out, so that I'm not tempted to do it. It's you know, I mean, it's easy way to do it, but I don't want to be dependent on it. Let's show you the cow area. I kind of want to get a supply of stuff going before I put the uh, cows in. Uh, I've already dumped some grass over there. Uh, I've been dumping, getting this going for the silage for them. Let's just go ahead and dump that. Then we will hook him back up over by my mower and then I'll we'll continue on with what I wanted to do today. hate that. If you know how to disable your course play so that you don't actually bump it, uh, I don't know how to stop it like right here to uh, I don't know the control unless it's right here. Uh, I don't know how to and then use it when I want it. You know what I mean? Uh, I don't know how to do that. I bump it. If I'm using uh, like in the woodworking, the woodworking, the lumber, then if I'm, a lot of times if I'm, well, this will work out pretty good. I can get that little bit there. It, uh, I always bump it, then I got to, uh, it's just annoying. Uh, I tried to remap it to another key, and that didn't work either, so. Get him going. Why not work a little bit? All righty. Let's see. Yeah, this is a, a big Haas modded uh, tractor. Uh, top speed, I think, is 40, but it gets up to speed real quick. Um, big Haas takes a lot of the mods, and he just, as he calls it, and I love to say it, he Haasifies them. Uh, he, he tweaks them to how he likes it. I'm part of his uh, Patreon. I support him. Uh, and then on his uh, TeamSpeak page, Discord page, uh, if you join his Discord, 
Uh, he's got a link to where you can get uh, all of his mods. Alrighty, we're just going to leave you off for now. Okay, here's some of the big bud. This tractor here is just a uh, modded tractor that I found. Uh, it's not very powerful, but it's real fast. And on this map, fast is good. It'll do, I think, a hundred and I'm not sure. Let's take it out here. Actually, we could just. Well, actually, I don't. I won't, I'll take it up and down to see what. You've seen some of my videos. Uh, you've seen this in it. I just like sticking it in there because uh, she'll just get down and go. Oh, I tell you what, we'll do. Since we're just doing this. We'll go back to the farm and I'll just show you where the, uh, okay, so you see the farm over here. This is the part of my field. Uh, I like it that a lot of stuff's not collidable. Uh, you can jump the water. That part's good. So if you come out of your farm and go right here, oh. And then head uh, east, southeast, east. Uh, you can see this is we're heading towards the uh, 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 buying area shop. See that? We're crossing field two, and there's one over there. So, more than likely, uh, I'll get enough money from my sales of the crops I got going. Uh, I'll buy field one. We'll just go into progression. We'll get field one, which is over here. Here's the shop. Here's field one. I'll probably buy that next. Uh, where is the uh, buy-in in icon? Let's see if I can find it. Of course, it's way down here. But the third biggest field, look at it. I mean, that's huge. So, like I said uh, in the beginning, it's big bud friendly. There are some uh, forestry, not much. This is the type of map that I think once you cut it down, you'd have to uh, replant or take a small part of one of these fields and plant maybe would be a way to do it, I think. Uh, but there is a, a sawmill logging and all that here. Also, if you look at the overlay to my left, looking at the, uh, you know, your your map four three two one all that to the left you notice that it you can see through it so you could actually have it up while you're doing stuff and it's not really going to bug you too much i think that that's kind of cool that they did that anyhow let's see what this cost come on oh i don't know why it hits there we go uh 302 million <coughs> three million twenty three thousand no missions at the moment on this one there are missions available on the map and I'm for whatever reason getting a little lag uh, let's see for where we at we'll just go ahead and uh, what I ought to do is finish doing we're in the area where the coins are let's pick up the rest of my uh, coins I wanted you to see how easy it was uh, to see them and pick them up. Looks like I need to go back this way. And so much storage areas on this map. Which is awesome because of the map being so large. Well, and there's a uh, cell point for your animals. Alright, let's just... Uh, let's see. Yeah, we'll go over here. And when you're looking for them... But they're they're very obvious. I did a lot of them last night. Uh, literally last night, I played quite a bit. Uh, but I did it at evening night on the map. And okay, so I should be. And of course, trying to do it while recording, I'm going to mess up. But uh, I put my flashlight on. I was able to see them. But there, see. They're very, they're not hid at all. Okay, so I got, okay, we're going to go back. So let's get this one next. See, very, very easy. There we go, there we go. And I'm back here. So, yeah, there's the other one there. 
and I wanted you to see when I did it 97 three more oh they're up here I was gonna run around in my uh, little bug thing that I got from Big Hoss uh, for pretty much this reason I wanted to have something to zip around the map looking for the coins there we go one two more left folks I'm not quite sure what the rewards are I think they I'm not sure we'll see this together there is nothing in my storage my my bins I have not so we'll see if we get actually get what we get we'll get money I'm hoping so I got 644,000 Okay, here we go. One more should be. They, there we go. They don't quite line up. Okay, so we got six hundred forty-four thousand. Uh, let's just take a look real quick. Oh, I do have some stuff in storage. I, I apologize. Ninety-eight thousand whatever of, of wheat, barley, canola. So you got a little bit, but not much. I'm just curious if you get full. Well, so you, so you see, there's not much there. I wonder if it fills up. All right, we did it. Your remarkable find that's your million dollars, which has been transferred to your account. And then I got a badge there. Uh, so I got a million. Very nice. Now it didn't give us. It didn't fill anything else out, which. You know, I was kind of hoping I got a little more here, but I got a million. Why not? That was, I mean, they made it very easy. Uh, where are we at here in the map? Let's just take a look here. Oh, this is a golden yarn spinnery. So, yeah, you probably sell your wool here. Uh, selling point for wool. All right. So, we did it. And you guys got to see me do it. I'm um, going to zip around because there we go. <laughs> yeah, stopping traffic. All righty. So uh, I want to uh, I'll just zip along this way with this guy. Get rid of that. So a basic map, big. Uh, the outline of the, once you get to this part, from a distance, it looks great. But when you get up to the edge of the map, like right here, uh, I don't really like it. But, you know, it is what it is. Okay, please land. There we go. Just wanted to see. Some of the trees are, most of the trees are no collide. See that? I can go right through it. So, so when you find a tree that you can cut down, then you'll you'll know that you can cut it down. <laughs> Duh. So you got not so like your cell points are like on the edge of the map. Here's uh oh this is your small farm, I think. Farm two, I think they call it. Again, I don't have so the writing shows up, but I think this is your second farm. It's got a silo where you can drop things. Also there's a dealy bob back there. Uh, <laughs> you have a dealy bob. Okay. I'm kind of curious at some of these feet. Okay, where am I at? Yeah, we're on the bottom, so I don't know. Maybe this is just a field you can mow. I don't know. You can come in here. I don't know what else it's for. But yeah, it looks like you can mow it. It's not animals. Animals are at the other side. Oh, this is the back side of your fields. Yeah, so I'm, I'm guessing this is something that you'll come in here and mow it. <clears throat> Which is nice if that's the case because your animals, well, your animals on the other side, so I guess that don't matter. So yeah, there's your fields again that you own, the two I own. I'm pretty well caught up. Uh, There's the other field. 
field four. Oh yeah, that's uh, the big field again. Alrighty. Yeah, I love when a tractor can go faster than a car. I love it. Again, this is not a big Haas mod. Well, it does 80. I thought it did faster. That little bug buggy that I got. Okay, the diner. Okay. So, yeah, your cell points are, I think, pretty much all on the outside of the map. I think the little red barn's coming up. I haven't really did a map tour myself. Uh, again, I just decided to look around a little bit. I've watched several other people. Yeah, here's your cell point for if you want to get rid of some of your extra straw, hay, and all that. Right there. Which would be handy as if, if that canola field was, uh, you know, straw, wheat, whatever. I think this is, uh, okay, so now we're getting back around to the, yeah, we're back around now. Cows and whatnot. So I'm about ready to buy them. Um, But let's take a look at my, uh, I got my sheep are over here. No, these are, this is the pig area, sorry. I got stuff set up though, uh, here. I dropped them off. Looks like I kind of went to the wrong spot. <laughs> and here's my sheep, uh, watering them. I've got wool pallet already. Uh, I don't know if they need water yet. They probably shouldn't. It hasn't been that long, but hey, why not? Uh, you can get water for free on the map. I tried back in this. I bought the wrong thing. Uh, so I ended up buying it. Oh, so it took a little bit. That's good. But I love the... I love this type of equipment. You know, now it's... You could use it for so many other things. I'm going to... I got this guy over here to put on him. It'll auto load the uh, uh, these bales of uh, wool. So I didn't really need that guy, but oh well, you know, I bought that before I did this. I bought me a, a little telehandler. I may just take this on down to the uh, BGA. I don't think I'll need it here, but it's there. I bought all the equipment for it. Well, actually, you need uh, you need the bucket for doing what I'm going to do. You clean up after your animals. <clears throat> the more you clean after them, then they'll produce what they need to produce. Okay, pick it up. Don't have it up. All right, let's back it up. There we go. Got the head down too far. Lift it up a little bit. There we go. You help if I can drive. There we go. Oop. Not much, but they're messy. They are messy. So I'm going to show you what I was talking about earlier. If I go and extend my boom up, then that comes up, my uh, course play. And I don't know how to get rid of it. And it's just aggravating me. So, anyhow. Yeah, we'll probably put him... Well, we'll have him here. I can't remember how far the BGA is from here. We'll, we're almost done. Let's see, I've been rambling on for 28 minutes. And we're about done with this video. Uh, I get over to the BGA. It's actually down here by your farm. So yeah, there's water. There's water back there. We can uh, back right down into. Here's the BGA. Your cell. Your cell. Your uh, re. If you uh, put your have to redo your vehicle. Let's say you run into water and you want to reset it. This is your reset point back here. Another. Uh, grass field. Oh yeah, here's the little guy I got from uh, Big Hoss. It got reset because I constantly uh, 
uh, tipping the dumb thing over. But I love this little bugger. This is a big Haas mod. Uh, he's just Haasified it. But this little guy will do like a hundred and something. And you can haul with it. So I was actually using it to uh, run around and get my coins last night. But I tipped it and yeah, that's Let's get her up to top speed, then we'll backtrack and I'll show you. Oh, set this one does 73. Okay, yeah, I... He's got, the. I mean, it's because of I... I don't know why. Anyhow, here's your uh, standard BGA. Uh, so I've been cutting grass, waiting for my corn to get done. Uh, let's see, I wonder if I can do some leveling with this guy. I found uh, if you get your uh, big bud, the big big bud, bring him in here, he will, his weight will flatten that out in no time. So I think that's pretty cool. Here's your, uh, whatever you call it, where you dump it. But it's a uh, it's good size. You can hit this whole thing. So digester. Well, folks, I think I'm going to end the tour and uh, map review and uh, update to the channel right here. Uh, if you like what you've seen, this is uh, I appreciate you hit that thumbs up. Thank you for all the new subscribers. You guys are totally uh, rocking the channel. I appreciate it so much. And uh, until we meet again, which, again, I'll be away from my computer here for a couple of weeks. Uh, I'll see you guys in the next video. I hope you all have a wonderful uh, Memorial Weekend, and uh, we'll catch you all later.